hi everyone. We're Carolina Liar. Um, my name is Ricard. I'm Chad. You all know Chad, obviously. <laughs> uh, today we're gonna talk a little bit about Drown. That is our first first single off of our new album, Wild Bless Freedom. Um, the song is uh, we're gonna do a little acoustic version today for you. Yeah, two so can, two guitar parts. Yeah, two guitars. Um, try to sing a little bit. <laughs> See if it plays out. Maybe yeah. it's something you could actually use at home. Exactly. Should we play like verse and play verse up to chorus? Yeah, let's try it out. We'll break that down for you guys. So this is how how we would play it acoustically. First verse, and the thing, I guess the only thing I could say about the playing, it's I'm trying to build that rhythmic thing with the guitar, like constantly repeating the top notes. Okay, so, basically, um, guitar wise for Drown, it's such a massive song uh, in a live situation, but when you break it down acoustically, it's it's pretty much built out of two parts. Uh, you have the verse. Sounds like this. And it's pretty much basically. I'm using a capo on the first fret um, to uh, to still keep the same voicings of the chords and be in the right key. <laughs> but it's uh, <laughs> Uh, start off with a C, C chord, G, A minor, F. Probably pretty much everybody knows those chords. <laughs> pretty good voicings, Calvin yeah, chords. Yeah. Um, We're trying to keep everything as easy as possible. Oh yeah, and then you go over to the chorus. It's an F. That's pretty much it. Should we run the song? Yeah, we can run the whole song and play play the whole tune. Yeah, let's do it.
without fatal mistake. just kind of providing more support for Rick's parts um, and this kind of thing where a dual guitar would be is you're going to try and find voices that are not necessarily the same thing that he's doing that way it sounds a lot bigger than what it actually is technically we're playing exactly. the same things but our yeah. voicings are just slightly and there's some inversions going on there that really backing each other up yeah that's quick true. about the guitars by the way I'm using Taylor guitars this one is a 916 I like Taylor, they keep a consistent sound throughout, no matter where you go, it's still gonna sound the same. <laughs> Which is a good thing. That is a good thing, God knows no, you. I, have a, I like these guitars a lot, they sound, sound good. And this was one that they built for us, Guild got us when we started a little bit of a road tour oh, yeah. a couple of years ago, um, and this thing has been a real road hog too, and this thing's probably around. played. I don't know, at least 150 shows probably, yeah. just acoustic wise, and it's a, a D40BG. It's a they blend big, good together. We figured that part out. Yeah, it's it, this is a bit boxier. Yeah, it's got a little bit more bottom on it, and it works more like a drum in yeah. that sense. It's you know all the nice cool color, pretty parts exactly. are coming from Rick, and I'm just basically beating a horse <laughs> over here. It's about the equivalent of my guitar playing. Just playing a drum. You know? <laughs> No, but they, they blend really, really well, and that's that's a good thing. So we use Taylor guitars and Guild guitars acoustically. Fenders. Yeah, Fender is, it's been a good friend <laughs> throughout the years. <laughs> cool, is that enough for Drown, you think?